<laughs> oh my god, I know Mrs. Saracen said to wear ugly sweaters, but seeing hers actually light up was incredible. It's truly a Christmas miracle it didn't catch on fire. Oh, and what about those reindeer antlers on Tyler's car? They used to be such a scrooge at Christmas and now look at them. Time has definitely mellowed them out. How was your hot cocoa, by the way? Did I get the marshmallow to cocoa ratio correct? What do I mean? You always had more marshmallows than cocoa in your mug when we were growing up. My mom used to have to hide the bag whenever you came over so we'd have some safe for ourselves. <gasps> I'm not lying! It's Christmas and I don't lie at Christmas. Oh, whatever. That's how you end up with lumps of coal on your stocking, bud. Well, at least we don't have to hide the fact that we spiked it anymore. I thought Chris' mom was going to kill us that time she caught us pouring bourbon into hot chocolates at the Christmas party. Oh, speaking of Chris, did I tell you I ran into him at the grocery store last night? Yes! I didn't realize he had moved back to town. Apparently, he and his partner decided that they wanted to settle down here and start a family. He had a small brood with him too, so I'd say he was successful in that regard. You know, he was always such a party animal, so it was interesting to see Chris the family man. But you know, I'm, I'm happy for him. Still, it's wild to me that we're old enough to be married and have kids and careers and stuff. It wasn't that long ago we were sneaking out past curfew and hanging out at that old abandoned house in the woods drinking cheap beer. Well, you drank cheap beer. I was much classier. I snuck cheap vodka and water bottles. <laughs> I can't believe it's been so long since we've hung out. We used to always hang out after these Christmas parties after our parents went to bed. Yeah, I know. We've both been busy. But it's nice, right? Hanging out again? I did miss you, you know? I'm sorry. I'm, I'm terrible about keeping in touch. I, I just... I don't know. Life happened, I guess. College took us to opposite sides of the country. Work is incredibly busy for both of us. Hell, quarantine literally ate almost two years of our lives. No, I know, I know, it happens, and that's, it's no one's fault, really. I just, I, I still wish it didn't happen, you know? Oh my god, I love this Christmas song. Wanna dance with me? Yes, I'm serious. Come on, come on, dance with me. Please. I'll give you extra marshmallows in your next cup of cocoa. <laughs> yes. I knew I could get you with marshmallows. <sighs> okay, so. Your hands go here. And mine go here. And yeah. Yeah, just like that. So, we need to be a little bit closer. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Okay, um, I'm going to step forward and you're going to step back. Ow. <laughs> it's okay. That's why I have two feet. <laughs> Don't apologize, it's okay. Okay, let's try this again. And don't look down, look at me, okay? Yeah. Um... I'm going one step forward, and you... Yeah, see? Now we're dancing. You know, it might be because we're slow dancing to a Christmas song, or because you're very, very close to me. Or might be a little bust from spiking the cocoa, but... You're really cute. <laughs> I mean, I always thought you were cute. I was just too... too chicken shit to, to say anything. 
especially as teenagers. Wait, really? Uh, okay, okay, you know, we might be idiots. <laughs> um, so, are you seeing anybody? Okay, look, I I'm only asking because I don't need somebody finding out I'm slow dancing with her partner behind their back. Is everything okay? Why are you coming closer? Do I have something in my face? Or... <laughs> Uh, whoa, w what was that for? L look up, what do you mean? Oh, the mistletoe? Did you know that was there the whole time? <laughs> of course you did, this is your parents' house after all. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm just, uh, yeah, yeah, flustered, hmm? Flustered is a way to describe it. It's it's just... I always liked you, but I never wanted to ruin our friendship. And now here we are, all these years later, standing under the mistletoe in our childhood home and... Okay, you can't keep doing that. What do you mean, what? I, I mean the kissing me in the middle of the sentence. We're turning into a walking cliche here. There's twinkling lights, soft Christmas music, a mistletoe. Please tell me how we're not in some romantic Christmas movie right now. Well, no, I'm not complaining. I, I just... <sighs> okay, fine. I'm fine with the kissing under the mistletoe thing. I, I just... If we... If we hadn't hung out tonight, would you have told me that you still like me all this time later? Christmas just made you bolder, huh? Mm-hmm. You don't like Christmas or whatever. How dare you throw my words back at me? I would tell Santa to put coal in your stocking for being such a jerk. Can... Can I kiss you again? You've kissed me twice now, so I think it's time I paid up. Yeah? Okay. <laughs> you know, I don't have any plans for our New Year's. How about you? You're up for drinking cheap beer in an abandoned old house? 